The aim was to create a link between future buildings and the site history. We discovered that local fishermen use traditional emirates fish traps, uh, which were braid themselves. Fish trap pattern is three directional. The basis of our site plot division is the pattern itself. It creates tight building block where narrow streets give shelter to pedestrians. The same pattern is used on the facades of the buildings. Every facade is different yet related to neighbor as the facade lines are continuous. This is a view from the plane. As you can see, the block is rising towards main road. Buildings are north, south directional. Pedestrian level is higher by 3.5 meters from main road and accessed by bridges or ramps. The streets are planned in a way that you can always have a direct view with the Y Greek and easily locate yourself. One of the main streets of pedestrian has a view, view to southeast to Bike Creek Tower. This picture shows the human scale atmosphere and the view to the tower. Site is divided into three different areas. The gray area is public spaces and streets. The semi-private area is green in, uh, in, in, in a quarter for relaxation and uh, blue, blue area is private area, which can only be accessed by boat or on foot. This is a view from pier to private area the, where buildings are on water. In the background, you can see the rising block. Multifunctional buildings are at the first floors of main pedestrian street. It creates a vital and uh, vibrant community. Full residential buildings are away from the main street. This is a view from the main street. And now about the solution in detail. So this fishnet-shaped section view shows two parking levels when only the second one is fully underground, which means that the first level is partially open to air and has natural ventilation. In total, there are 700 parking spots and one speciality. These are those uh, three spots for planting that grow up to the parks on the first level because uh, greenery is really necessary here in Dubai. Um, in total, there are 37 buildings, whence the building area for one is 300 square meters. And we developed three different types of plants. This one has two one-bedroom apartments, this one studio and two bedroom apartments, and the biggest one has three bedrooms. As the roofs are really exclusive, therefore are the apartments on the upper levels. For instance, this is three bedroom apartment on two levels. And what is also really important is the fact that while the south and north sides are open to the sun with shaded and glassed balconies and hallways, then the east and west sides are more closed with medium window surface in order to protect the buildings from the heating and critical sun. So, as you probably didn't notice before, were the details. For instance, every retail area has entrance from niche in order to protect people from the sun, and the facades are special too, which means that they are covered with uh, airtight glass and special perforated metal sheet, which is covered with uh, titanium dioxide, which is self-cleaning, and is able to absorb carbon dioxide from the outdoor air and it is also visible true. So we also developed a special uh, wind tunnel system in order to cool hallways. The aim is to make sure that cool people and also the air intake is in accordance with the main wind direction. The barometric proofs visible are actually prepared metal sheets, while the insulated roofs are horizontal and have technical roofs on top of them and the balconies are glazed and shaded. And with all those uh, dense planning methods, special constructions, we were able to create a energy efficiency glass house. So in conclusion, 
as we come from Estonia with only one million population, then uh, those small scale atmospheres and human scale is really important for us. And we hope that with this Fishnet district, we are able to create something really convenient, sustainable, desirable, but also innovative in the context of Dubai. Thank you.